Hello, Optimus 405, and we're back for another Transformers video review. Today, this is going to be part 2 of Transformers Creo Leader Class Optimus Prime. Uh, the first part was showing off the robot mode and all its features and everything else. We're doing the same thing, except this time in field mode. I did this last night after... I think I did my third field lock, I can't remember. I started this at 1 o'clock a.m. and it took me to like around 4 o'clock a.m. So it took me almost 3 to 4 hours. But here we go. Um, it's basically off his, um, the Peterbilt truck. And just before we go on more into review, I just do want to say that this is in a new location. Um, probably going to be the best station as it's going to be. There you go. So, probably going to be bed lighting. Probably more reviews are going to be in this area because more lights going to be shining in. It's going to be good. So, we're going to look at the trailer first. Now, this piece always likes to stay attached to the trailer. Right back. Let's put off time side. So here's the trailer. It's basically uh, just a regular trailer. Now I did outfit it out a little bit to make it more sturdy wise. Um, uh, I can see that there is a piece right here. You can't see it because it's all black. But it keeps this from breaking off. Uh, the trailer hitch can't open. <clears throat> so it can store anything inside of it. Um, the bikes. I don't have the bikes in here, but I cut them out. And then you take off this piece. Now this piece is usually on it. I attach the red one just to keep it on better. Then you unfold it. And just like the G1 solve and I think it could do the same thing as yeah, just standing up. You have prime in it and do everything else. Now these two um plastic bits I actually did add on because they kept falling apart. Um but that's basically the trailer. Um just patch it back on. Pieces do like to fall off. And that's just how this thing is. Yeah, put this back on how it is. And that's basically the trail. So let's put that off on the side. So here's the main thing of the whole video. Okay. Yeah, there you go, that looks better. So sorry if I'm zooming out a little bit. So here's the trailer. It's um uh, trailer. Here's the cab of the vehicle of the truck. It's pretty nice. I do like it. The grill's all nice. Um there were stickers on here. I actually just took them off. I'm thinking about just taking off all the uh get that in a second. All the uh about Decals off. Maybe it'll just look a lot better. It's not. Okay, there we go. So it's pretty much nice. Um, the wheels are all rubber, so it does roll pretty good. Um, this keeps on tapping. Let's just get to this. So the back of his truck come off, and it almost looks like the regular Peterbilt truck now. Um. The whole bag is, it looks like a regular truck. But this is the command center for the Creons to use. Uh, basically just opens up and it's just like, it's a mini computer. Just a minute. So it's just pretty much all computer details and everything else. Uh, the doors do open. 
And yes, they do open at a weird angle. I think I may have the doors on the wrong side. Come on. That may not be a good thing. Um. Yeah. No, the doors were on the right side. That's... Hmm. Uh... Oh, come on. Oh. Okay, so... Let's see if you can focus. Yes. See that piece right there? Yeah, that just broke off. So I just broke a door on this hinge. But it was pretty nice details all the way around. But the trail is nice. Um, sorry about that. Um, dropping my phone. So this is a, a nice trailer, oh god, trailer, nice, um, truck, um, uh, just one minute guys, I just need to do something. Oh, nice thing, nice try to spell you. Um, the doors do open up, and pieces are going flying. Um, so yeah, I mean, I think you can see in there, but there's a steering wheel, there's a seat, there's everything else. Um, that's a pretty nice truck. Now, as a whole set, if I had to pick up another one, um, I would have definitely done it just to keep one in robot mode and one in vehicle mode. Um, do this off camera because Trail Hitch usually likes to stay on to prime. Come on, come on. There we go. Yeah, this is. Um,. No, that's zoom in. Zoom out. Okay. So, as an overall, it's not a bad truck and it's not a bad cab. Um, I think if you leave this piece off, it actually looks like a lot better vehicle. Uh, it just sucks I actually broke the piece off. Because the other piece is completely bent now. Yeah. But I mean, he's nice. He has all like details. The only thing I have to say is when you transform him to robot to vehicle or vehicle to robot, is be careful with the parts because some parts are different colors than the others. Uh, it will get you messed up. I have done it before, and it was a pain. Um, I know when I done it a couple times, I hated myself. But yeah, you do have a lot of pieces left over due to your arms, and I think, oh, no, oh. and other bits. But I don't think you could do anything about that. Um, both of the bikes could fit in there. I think you have both the crayons fit in there. Pretty much do anything. Um. But do I recommend getting you this? Uh, getting this set? Do I recommend you having this set? No, <laughs> this thing's not for sale. Um, no. If you could find him for the cheap price, uh, I think I 
he used to go for sixty dollars. I got him like for like almost thirty dollars. I got him half off at Walmart, which is pretty cool. If you get him for the right price, I say pick it up. Um, if your kid is getting this, I recommend adult or a supervisor to help because there is a lot of pieces. I do have the box, I'm not going to shoot it in camera, but I believe there is, it says ages 8 to 14, so anything below 8 doesn't work, and there's just about 542 pieces in this whole set, and it comes with two manuals, so it depends on what your interest is in. But, hey, Christmas is coming around. If you can still find this thing, I say get it. Get it. So, this is Optimus 405. Hope you guys have a great night. Please like, favorite, and tell your friends about me. It's always nice to get more subscribers. So, I'm not asking. I'm not saying I'm needing. But it's always nice to have more subscribers. But, I'll see you guys next time. Take care.